So this is a KLR 650 Kawasaki and uh, it's got a bit of an oil leak, kind of annoying because uh, if it sits on a cement floor overnight then the next day there's usually some drips of oil on the floor there and uh, I didn't really look into it very much and uh, somebody else actually pointed it out for me. He says, uh, he said, said it was coming from here and I, and I looked and sure enough you know, it just kind of looks like a scratch, but it's more than a scratch. It's actually a little bit of a dent, and it's enough to create a tiny crack right there, and there is oil coming out of there. So uh, today I'm going to do a really simple uh, fix on that. And uh, this is something I did when I was 15 on a, a 79 XR500, and uh, the base gasket, the bottom of the cylinder on the other side, it uh, was leaking oil pretty good right in here. So what I did is I cleaned it really nice and then uh, I just took some silicone and I made a bead you know along that seam from the outside and uh, let it dry and I, I drove, I probably drove like a couple of years like that and it worked really good to seal it up. You know there's no pressure really in the crankcase in that area because the crankcase is vented and you know it's not gonna like try to blow that silicone off of there. So Really an ideal fix would just to uh, TIG weld this a little bit, but I don't have a TIG welder and, and uh, maybe some JB weld would be the next step, but uh, I'm just going to do a really quick one. I'm going to clean it with some brake cleaner and then I'll just uh, put some, some silicone on there and then uh, leave it sit overnight and we'll call it fixed. See that's not so bad. It's not exactly TIG welding or anything, but it should keep that oil in there. 